Hey guys, so I have a video today. It's um, a challenge video. It was started by Faithers K. It's the um, finish what you started uh, challenge type thing. And I actually saw it from Lindsay, whose username is bunny9585. I'll put links to both of them below because um, they're both awesome. I was watching, they, I watched their videos, which what you do is... Um, uh, you have products that you've started that you got like halfway through or almost all the way through and then you stopped using them for whatever reason um, and then you don't use them again and the challenge is to use them up. Um, what Faith did in hers was she put a time limit on herself. I'm not going to put a time limit. I'm just going to use them until they're done. <laughs> um, but either way works. So I figured I would do a video on the products that I want and need to just use up. Um, I have them in this little bowl thing. Um, there's, let's see, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11. There's 11. She, like the first one she had, she had like 45 and the other one she had, I don't know, like the biggest pile I've ever seen. Um, but I think this is good for me. Um, because if there were more, if there were a lot more than that, I doubt I'd even, I probably wouldn't finish it. Probably wouldn't even try. I don't know. But anyway, so I have my 11 right here. So I'll get started and just show them to you. The first, everyone knows what this is, the EOS Lip Balm Egg. 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 <laughs> this thing. Um, I used this much of it. Top of the dome is gone. It's flat. It's awkward. It's a crappy lip balm. And I don't like this. But, you know, I'm already down to here. Just need to use it up. I'll keep it next to my... Um, I could either put it in my purse or I can just keep it here where I do my makeup. And every day when I first start to put this on, because I'm always like, oh, where's my CarMax? <laughs> so I'll use this for now. Get rid of that sucker. The next thing I have here, everyone's going to be like, wow, why would you hate that? Mm -hmm. And it's the um, L'Oreal Carbon Black. I don't know if it's supposed to be a liner intense or linear intense. I've heard it said both ways. I say linear. But liner would make sense, but linear line. What? It does not matter. Anyway, um, everyone knows what it looks like. This would be like my favorite mascara if it wasn't for the fact that when it gets on my lashes, it makes them like sticks and they stay right where they are and then when you put your mascara on it, mascara can't do what it's going to do because this is like keeping it from doing that and I can't stand that so that's why I hate this but maybe I'll fall in love with it or at least figure out a way to not have that happen because my eyelashes are always in the way when I do my liquid liner because they naturally have a curl so they're sticking up <laughs> um but anyway so want to finish this up and I used a lot of this because I used it for a long time it has to be at least halfway through um, if not more uh, so gonna use that up then the next is also a liquid liner and it's my in color fabu liner and I used to use these for years um, years and years and years I love these um, but then I found my NYX one and my Milani one and I love those even more but I have this and these don't take long to go through so I'm just going to use this up instead of letting it go to waste. Um, the next two things are mascaras but this one's like a brow powder. Um, I used to use it all the time. There's not a lot left in it. I don't know if you can see into the tube. You can see the wand here. But um, there's not a whole heck of a lot of this left so I figure just use it up. Get rid of it. Um, I used to use it like every day and then I don't know why I don't know why I stopped using it but I did so we're gonna use that up. Then the next is the Rimmel Lash Accelerator. I despise this mascara and I have this whole big thing of like eyeliners and mascaras and all this stuff that like I haven't used and they're really old and they need to all just be thrown away but this I've gotten more recently so I'm really gonna try to use this up and if I don't use it up at least use it because I don't. So I'm going to try to use this even though I cannot sand it. Whatever. I'm going to try to use it. And the next two things, um, if you've seen um, other videos of mine, you probably know that I can't use foundation. I, def I cannot use liquid foundation. It all makes me break out. Um, 
to what I use is the Sally Hansen Spray Makeup. But um, I used to use this. This is my Bare Minerals um, foundation. So I'm going to try to use this up. I don't I don't think it's going to do anything to my skin. I'll I'll probably try to use it with my little, it's, not, it's like the Beauty Blender, but it's the Sony Kashuk one. I'll probably try to use it with that and just use it with a brush, see what way it works better. Um, as long as it doesn't start causing anything, um, you know, with my skin, I'm going to try to use that. And then I've got the Mineral Veil. I'm going to try to use that right along with this. <laughs> um, then the next thing, um... I got this so long ago. Yes, it's by LA Colors. Ridiculous, right? This was like one of the first things of... Not the first things of makeup I got. Well, yeah, it was one of the first things of makeup I ever got. And I... Oops. I used this much of it. It's not bad or anything. Um, not the best powder in the world. And I don't usually use powder. But if I'm going to, I'm going to try to use this one. Because it's already to here. You know what? Just use it up. Whatever. It's fine. Um... And the next thing is this, whoa, I'm going to drop this bowl, my mom's going to kill me. The next thing is this Rimmel Blush in Santa Rose. Um, this is in their old packaging when they were really little. Um, I used to love this, as you can see, this is, used to have a crown on it, you can kind of see it right there. Oops, used to have a crown, um, but I used it a lot, so the crown's gone. Um, and now that I actually use foundation, um, my face isn't red like it used to be because it's covered up. And so I figure I can, you know, use this, put a little bit of color back in my face, not much, but like more out here. So I could start using that, see how that works out for me. Try to, if not, if I don't use it up, oh well, I want to at least try to use a lot of it because um, I just put it on actually in the bathroom before this and you can't tell right now because I've got all this crazy awkward lighting, but um, it actually doesn't look half bad. It looks pretty good. I'm not really into bright pink blushes or anything like that. But I like this one and I used to love it, so I'm going to try to use that. And then the last two things are eyeshadows. And this this one right now, this one here, is so funny because this always was my old highlighter color. And it was the Maybelline New York eyeshadow in linen. And I don't even know if you're going to be able to see the, what's left of it. Yeah, there you go, right there. This corner here, and then right there. And that's all that's left of it. And that's where I stopped using it. Talk about the dumbest thing in the world. There's nothing left. So... That should go fast, so I'm going to finish, yeah, I'm going to use that as my highlight, or try at least, and finish that up, which will probably take like a day or two. Then the last thing is the oldest eyeshadow I think I have. Um, it's by Maybelline, but it's old. You remember this packaging? Um, old, old, and it looks like this, and as you can tell, I hit pan right in the middle. I used to use this all the time. And then I stopped, um, this eyeshadow, these old ones are actually had a lot more, or not a lot, but they had more in them than these ones do. Uh, these single eyeshadows have .09 ounces and these have .13. But it really is like a cool color. It's like a slate gray with kind of like this purple-y tone to it. I don't know, it's really, really cool. And... Honestly, this is way more pigmented, even with being old and whatever, this is way more pigmented than and any shadow of theirs I've tried within the past couple of years, and I've tried a lot, so, like this, and, or I used to love this, so I'm going to definitely try to use this up, and being that it's a really cool color, um, hopefully I will be able to, but yeah, so, that's, that's the last thing, um, so not many, but, you know, at least it'll kind of get me going in the right direction. Um, so yeah, that's everything, and um, I'll update, I'll do an update, you know, as it goes along, maybe as I, like, start finishing things, or, like, you know, whatever, if I'm not finishing things, but I'll, uh, I'll do updates on it. And if you'd like to join me, that would be awesome. You can post a video response or post just a comment. Um, and if you try it or you are already doing it, good luck, good, good luck. And I hope you like the video and I'll talk to you guys soon. Bye.